If you're buying a bulldog, this is a bulldog. The old time, the Victorian, the American, the Sussex, the Dorset, they're not bulldogs. This is the only bulldog. The colours of bulldog can be red, can be fawn, can be white, can be brindle. They can be smut, which is a solid colour with black hairs going through it and they can have a black muzzle. Um, a lot of them also carry white, so you can have a red and white, brindle and white, as this chap is. There's also undesirable, unrecognised colours being bred, which is black, black and tan and tri-coloured bulldogs. This colour could always crop up in the bloodlines um, and be bred accidentally. Respectable, reputable breeders done their very best not to produce those colours and if they did produce it, they found a foster home for the dog, they didn't sell it, they fostered it so it'd never be bred from and also they never registered the dog. There's been people trying to make some money, they're now going around saying they're a rare colour, they're not rare, they're undesirable, uh, we don't want the colour in the breed um, and they're charging massive amount of money for these dogs. Well. As I said, they used to be given away, so why people are paying for them, I don't know. The colour blue, trop, blue, lilac and chocolate, no idea where those colours have cropped up in the last few years. The dogs that I have seen, I would really query whether they're actually purebred bulldogs, even though they've got Kennel Club registered papers, they're nothing like our bulldogs. And when you start crossbreeding bulldogs, you lose the temperament. You're better off um, not buying from online selling sites. Respectable people do not normally advertise their dogs on there. They don't have to. You get a lot of scams on there. You get puppies brought in on their lot by the lorry load from different countries. They're too young to have their rabies inoculation, but they've been given it, so it's not effective. Trading standards are seizing those puppies from their new owners and putting them into quarantine. If you go to the Bulldog Breed Council website, on there you'll see the secretaries of the breed clubs. Ask them to recommend a good breeder to you. Um, also, to go to some of the Bulldog shows, go and meet the breeders and mix with the breeders. That's where you'll get a nice healthy dog, because the Bulldog breeders and show people are trying so hard to breed good healthy dogs and they're health testing them and DNA testing them. Um, the colour Merle is being brought through into the country. They can't register the colour, but it's a very, very dangerous gene. Some of these dogs are born with no eyes, they're born deaf, they're born deformed. Um, and in buying and encouraging unrecognised colours, that's what the sort of thing that's going to be going on. So go to the Bulldog Breed Council, look on their website for the secretaries, ask them to recommend a good breeder to you or go to a bulldog show and meet good breeders, people that care about the dogs, their welfare and their health. Don't buy off online selling sites.